We know now that there are so many violations of human rights by the state that relying on the common law and on parliament to correct is not good enough. We can say in the case of, of Mr Ward or the case of Cornelia Rao or the case of all the indigenous children left without education and health that the common law and freedom of the press and parliament are not providing protection. So the logical next step is for the parliament to use its legislative power and legislate for those commitments they've already ratified with UN conventions. Nothing new, but just making it real in Australia through Australian legislation. Thank you.